And now at 5.30, new surveillance video shows the moment surrounding a horrible car crash in Miami that takes one life and leaves another man in critical condition. Adding to the mystery, police say two men fled the scene. It all happened in darkness late Sunday night, and four men were returning home from a restaurant when suddenly their SUV was T-boned by a pickup truck. At least two victims are still at Jackson Memorial Hospital. CBS 4's Peter Dent spoke with family members, and he joins us now live from the hospital. Peter. Rick, family members can't believe the two men took off. They were inside the pickup truck that T-boned the SUV. Front seat passenger in an SUV, 56-year-old Reynaldo Murillo, did not survive. Now, new surveillance tape shows the impact. Surveillance cameras capture what looks like flames as two vehicles collide around 11.30 Sunday night. Several other cars keep going and some stop. These bright lights show the moments when a Buick SUV is T-boned by a Dodge pickup truck at the intersection of Northwest 27th Avenue and 36th Street. Police say two men in the truck did not help those in the SUV and fled on foot. It's terrible. It's very, very, very bad. Nadia Vargas can't believe the two men took off. Her friend, seen in this photo, Marco Navoa, was injured. He had pain and he had shock, right, for impact. Hay personas locas. Novoa's mother told me there are always crazy people driving in the streets. Novoa injured his right elbow and ribs, but was not seriously hurt. Police say this accident did take the life of a front seat passenger and left a back seat passenger in critical condition. Friends say they were returning home from a restaurant. Son personas que conozco de años. Nelly Alvarez says she has known some of the victims for years and says they are good people. It's terrible. It's terrible. It's terrible. Alberto Somariba manages a shell station whose surveillance cameras capture this deadly crash. The police had to, to make to, uh, all possible to, to catch this, this guy, man. And Miami police are appealing for help. There are lots of cameras here in the area. We're just asking that these two individuals come forward. Northbound from here, they were seen running across State Road 112 and were lost uh, north of the intersection. Investigators are not sure if these two men caused the accident, but they are looking into the possibility that their vehicle ran a red light. Now again, police are not sure if those young men caused this accident. Uh, the driver of the SUV actually confronted the two men before they took off. They could face some serious charges for leaving the scene of a deadly accident, and police are looking into whether someone may have run a red light. If you can help, call Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. We're live in Miami, Peter Danch, CBS 4 News. Peter, thank you.